Wow, that hurts. <laughs> Need gloves. Hey guys, welcome back. It is July 29th. I thought I'd give you a walkthrough of the chestnut orchard. Um, it uh, They're looking great. The trees look fantastic. Um, I like to say work hard and do what you love. And yesterday I spent a lot of time with a hand mower, weed eater, trimmers, um, and then some uh, some tube casings to uh, try to protect the bottom of the trees from deer rubbing on them this fall. And so we've probably got about a month and a half before the deer, um, before their antlers are hard and uh, they'll be hitting them pretty hard after that. Uh, so need to get all that work done. So it's a lot. We've got 88 Dunstan chestnuts here and uh, they're really looking good. Our tallest tree. It's looking pretty good. So the trees look really good. Lots of healthy looking burrs. And the stress on the trees is all focused on deers rubbing on them. So that's our opportunity is to take rubs like that and cover them up. And the way we're doing that is by taking these, these are five foot tubes and I actually have been cutting them down and you can grow seedlings in these tubes, which is a good idea, uh, but they also are working really well for uh, to keep the bucks from rubbing on them. So the bucks might rub on them, but it should protect it. And uh, started that, I've got about 15 or 16 of them done. A lot more to go. All right, so there is your late July chestnut at Creek Rise Outdoors update. I'll give another one in a month and hopefully the one after that, I'm actually filming a nice buck eating on some of these chestnuts. That would be really, really cool. So I'll keep you posted with that. Thanks for following along. Until then, I've got a lot of work to do to fill out these, those um, uh, covers on the trees to make sure that uh, the deer don't kill any more here this fall. I appreciate you guys following along. Hope you have a fantastic day and whatever you're doing inside, outside, make it a great one. Work hard, do what you love. See you guys.